everyone welcome to live with kim man i feel like we have a lot to talk about oh god just i feel like this is a really good time um we had a launch on live with kim day so i'm anxious to get what everybody is thinking right now those of you who went rewards today those of you who are already in rewards you guys can chime in but first of all welcome everybody man um it's been, it's been a day i can tell you that much but before we even get into it as people are coming in guys don't forget to hit that like button and if you're new here don't forget to subscribe so um and then also to tonight's live will be on podcasts tomorrow morning on everywhere you can listen to a podcast mainly apple spotify and then also while you're there if you're looking for a- another fantastic podcast go check out jason terry's podcast and that is the gig economy podcast especially if you love listening to podcasts as you're driving so anyway so uh, Okay, so right now I see 17 people here. Why don't you guys all put in right now? Did you guys go to rewards today? Yes or no? Just real quick so we can kind of see where everybody's at um, as far as where you guys are at for today. So for rewards, I, I'm platinum, baby. Um, platinum is here for me. Um, I feel like not that I was stressing out about it, but like the I woke up and I was ready to go this morning and nothing still dive in. I'm like, really? (laughs) Where did where? Like, why didn't they just upload it overnight? Right. So uh, I'm working and I'm working it and um, I start talking to other drivers and then like towards probably like early afternoon, probably like one ish, like another driver that I know, she's like, I got it. Do you got it? I'm like, no, I don't have it yet. And then finally mine came through, I believe at three o'clock this afternoon. Um, so it was later on in the afternoon. So before we even, that's kind of, that's kind of where I started today. So I don't have, hold on, we're going to get into it, but before we even do it. So first of all, hello, everybody. And hello, Christopher. Thank you so much for gifting um, membership. I really appreciate it. Scotland has my heart. How are you, Brian? What's up, my friend? Josh, how are you? Um, Who else am I missing? Thomas, what's going on? Uh, the driven. Hey, Tony, what's going on? Um, Anthony, how are you? Sheila, how are you? Tyler Thurston, um, new Dash program went live in your market today. Oh, luckily, I was already prepared. Well, that's fantastic. Um, anybody else I missed? GJD, did I say that right? <laughs> how are you? Another Brian, what's going on? Oh, you've been in the tier system since December. Okay, you can probably teach us a whole bunch of things that we don't know yet. Red Rocket, it's still not in Jersey. See, I was, I mean, I stand corrected. I thought all of New Jersey went reward. So you're proving me wrong. So sorry, guys, I was wrong. Um, There's, I guess, parts of New Jersey that didn't go reward. So hi, welcome, Red Rocket. How are you? Um, Anybody else I'm missing? George, what's going on? Uh, uh, Jersey Jack, how thank you. You know, I keep forgetting, isn't it horrible that this weekend is Mother's Day? <laughs> is Mother's Day? I feel like it's not even there. So, no new rewards program in Taylor Ham country. Oh, that's interesting. So, there are parts of New Jersey that didn't go today. That's interesting. Um, but it's pork roll, by the way. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> so, anyway, so I did not get rewards until 
three o'clock this afternoon. So I had, I made my family dinner. I ate real quick and then I was dying. Hey, Bubba Sue, I was dying to get out there and really kind of figure it out. And I'll be honest, I probably didn't figure that much out because I was able to take three maybe four, four orders um, this evening. So I really don't have my thought, my thoughts yet and all the ins and outs figured out in four deliveries. Um, so unfortunately, if you're looking for that, uh, I'm not going to be intelligent right now enough to talk rewards, but I can, I feel like we can compare in notes a little bit um, and kind of go into it. So I'm going to actually bring my phone down because I did not have time to actually make slides. So I don't know you can see that. So I am, I am platinum. Um, but this is what mine say. And you guys are going to have to see if, um, I guess, if it is the same in your own area, because this is mine. So I now get top priority for high paying orders. I have access to large orders, but it says if you have a catering bag, which they have mine on file, I'm going to assume I'm going to have to follow up with them just to make sure that I am still a part of this program. Um, so it does require you to have a catering bag. I can dash now anytime, which I've from talking to a couple of you guys in some areas, that's not the case. And even in platinum, you had to schedule, which by the way, I've been scheduling for like weeks now, preempting platinum. So I thought that was interesting. V, IP, Dasher support, and then early access to scheduling. So those are, I guess, my perks, so to speak, um, on what the program. So do you guys, are you guys similar? Is it different in your own area? Yeah. So, okay, let's, let's get, let's get, let's get caught up. So Brian, you got yours around one o'clock today. Okay. That's interesting. Cause I know you're not too far away from me. <laughs> um, so yeah. Oh, so you're in North Jersey, Red Rocket. Okay. That's interesting. So I wonder if it's Central Jersey and South Jersey that went, that'd be interesting to know that, huh? Interesting. Okay, so North Jersey did not get it. Interesting. Okay, so raised on Scrabble, how are you? Yeah, you are one of the areas where Platinum gets first priority to Dash now, but it's not guaranteed. So that's what I was, I'll be honest, I was expecting that. So like I've been scheduling, I always schedule and I have always scheduled since I started DoorDash, but like I've been really diligent lately because we all slip up every once in a while and forget to schedule but i've been very diligent and not only that but i've been really making sure like i schedule in specific intervals in case i get like catering orders in the afternoon in case like you know i get a break and so i can actually go and like shove something down my throat real quick so i've been very strategic on my scheduling so i was thinking that that was going to be my area and that's not the case not that i'm complaining because i'll be honest i was pleasantly surprised <laughs> but yeah so cheers. Oh, and Christopher, I saw you. So you tried the coconut Dr. Pepper. How was it? I'm just curious. So I, I found it. I just haven't tried it yet. I'm not the, I mean, I'll tolerate coconut. I'm just not like a big, huge fan of coconut. So I don't know whether I will, maybe I need to do kind of like I did the Dr. Pepper peeps. Maybe I need to do a live trying the coconut Dr. Pepper. <laughs> Okay, so you've had it here since March. Interesting. So interesting enough, I, like I said, I've only taken one, two, three, four, four orders. And three of the four orders this evening were um, the, plat the platinum symbol. Is that what we're calling it? I'm so, like, I feel like diamonds are so embedded in our brains, but it's not diamonds. It was platinum orders. So I got three platinum orders. They were not pluses. They were just regular platinum orders, pretty decent orders. And then I got one non, I was going to say diamond again, non-platinum orders. So, um, yeah. <laughs> so, 
that was kind of like my my four orders that I've taken so far. Um, like like I said, I've been popping in to other creators' lives um, at some points today, just to kind of see what they were up to. And some people are seeing plus signs. Um, I have not seen a plus sign yet, so I guess more to come. I'll be really interested because I literally I'm planning my entire day tomorrow all DoorDash. Um, I purposely didn't even take a catering order tomorrow. I literally want to work an entire DoorDash day from morning to evening to kind of see what an entire day does in my market. So that way I can like literally kind of dissect it a little better and I can know the program and how it actually works in my own area. Um, so anyway, so that's kind of my plan going into tomorrow. Um, I can't wait to dive into it, I have to say. I feel like it's a new shiny toy that, you know, you want to kind of figure out what's going on and how to work it. And, you know, I don't, I, I don't really know beyond that. I'm, I'll be honest. I was going to do tonight and it kind of ruined my plans, but I was thinking about doing like a live while I was out on the road so we can kind of see the orders together. But it came through so late in the afternoon. I didn't think it was going to be here in time for this evening. So I kind of scratched um, that idea tonight. But I don't know, I guess more to come as it kind of keeps going out. <laughs> Um, so Erin, you have 4.5, 98, and 95. Man, my luck stunk today so far. I am so sorry. Um, $2.50, $3.50, $5 tips for 1 p.m. Oh, I'm sorry. Like I said, I, I feel like I haven't really delved into it to really figure it out yet, but Okay, so Christopher, you're saying that is very coconut forward. See, that's what I'm afraid. Like, I'm afraid that the coconut is going to overpower, like, the cherry flavor of Dr. Pepper, and then you're not going to be able to really taste the Dr. Pepper. Like, I don't mind, what is it, the cream soda one, the vanilla one? I don't mind that one because you can actually taste the Dr. Pepper, even though it's like a cream, cream soda in there, I guess. But anyway, I'll, I'll still have to try it. <laughs> Okay, so Constantini said the three tier thing is a next level scam. I guess time's I guess time's gonna tell. I guess I I I don't know much about it. I'll say that. So I feel like I'm going into this objectively. Hopefully, I'm going into this objectively and really figuring out um, what it means what it doesn't mean like you thank you guys by the way you guys have been so amazing preparing all of us for it with all the comments that have been coming in guys keep them coming in because i feel like that's how we learn from each other i a lot of you guys say don't ever fall below 70 percent because the dash now is all the thing of the cheer program um i'm just going by what people have been putting in the comments but i appreciate each and every one of you guys for um giving us the heads up <laughs> okay so you will either take a ton of trash or you will have a hard time taking anything at all okay well here i guess cheers guys here's to um a new program um that's coming out but i will say it's been a wacky week leading up to this week did you any of you guys find that that's why i actually made the video this past week because um man it was I was seeing some really wacky orders, hidden tips where there shouldn't be hidden hidden tips. Like it was just a really wacky week, majority of the week. Did you guys find this or maybe they just blocked my account? I don't know, but um, earn by time was not available for majority of the week. There was maybe once it was available. I feel like they thought pe new pe or new people were trying to do the climb for platinum. And they just completely restricted earn by time in my, at least for me, they did. I don't know whether it happened um, for, every, for every area. So it was, it was just interesting. Hey, DoorDash Rick, how are you? 
Um, but yeah. So believe me, I'll find out next week because I have to take a look back going back four weeks and the number or whatever it says four weeks ago. I have so many dashes. I will say the one thing I actually do like in this, there's now that new um, metric that actually shows you how many orders you've done in a rolling 100. Is it 100? I think that's what it said. Um, so you always know, yeah, the last 30 days. So that way you always know where you stand to see if you have enough deliveries to reach the platinum level. So that's one of the things I actually, I think it was a good um, addition to the metrics that we're seeing. Um... Platinum hit my market today. Fantastic. So you guys are all, all along with me, right? <laughs> um, what was your first order? Platinum. Mine was six dollars and for 3.5. Mine was eight dollars for 3.6. So that was my very first platinum order that came through. So it was actually, it wasn't horrible. I'll be honest. I was expecting them to throw like the worst of the worst out at me today. I, I, I was like bracing myself for it. And then when I got three platinum orders out of the four deliveries I did, I'm like, okay, you know, it could have been a lot worse. I feel like I've dealt with a lot worse this week because I didn't want my AR to go down at all. Um, so I felt like I was, I took a lot of orders last week in just to give you guys an example, I did 120 deliveries, um, last week. And that was literally just me just taking orders last week. So, Hey, I I'll be honest. I had a good DoorDash week on top of it. So I really, I can't complain, um, because I was making money. So I guess as long as I'm making money, you know, We'll say that's that's what it's all about, right? We're here we're here to make money, right? Okay, so Mary, your first order was nine dollars seventy five cent for two point two miles. That's actually pretty awesome. Good job. Hey, Bud Soda. So nope, high pay order diamonds still in. Told them I was avoiding it as long as so it did not come to you yet. Interesting. And it's funny, Bud Soda, because normally you get a lot of programs before in New York before I get them in New Jersey, which I actually find interesting. Usually it's the flip-flop way, way around. <laughs> okay, so Sheila, you're going to try it out dashing in the new tier system tomorrow and see how it goes. Yeah, that's, I'm telling you, that's, that's my plan. So I'm, um, I literally, I didn't take any cater, as of right now, <laughs> <laughs> I said if a catering order came through that was really good, I would take it, but I have not found that yet. So as of right now, I am dedicating my very first day tomorrow to all DoorDash. It doesn't mean I might not turn on Uber Eats during slow times or even Grubhub or Instacart during slow times because you guys know me, I can't sit still. <laughs> yeah, but that's a pretty awesome order. Uh, so congratul congratulations. So Christopher, tier program won't matter to me. They won't let me dash for more than 30 minutes at a time. You hold, I, you know, you're not the first person that I've heard that. I've heard that I'll, like if you don't schedule, I don't know personally, but I've heard that if you don't schedule and you try to dash now, you could only do it for like half hour to an hour at a time, which I find interesting. What I really want to no, and maybe that's just me, is how does it affect my oversaturation issue I have in my my own area? So I really want to see how, if, if it impacts that positively for me or negative for, negatively for me, I want to see um, how it interacts with other dashers in my area and whether it makes a difference, the amount of dashers that they're allowing on during a certain time of the day. So <laughs> you have nine orders in the last 30 days, um, but me and DoorDash need space. That's actually really funny. <laughs> I actually really love that. Maybe, maybe you need to put them on a timeout. <laughs> That's actually pretty awesome, Becky. <laughs> um, but yeah, so 
Okay, George, so you say no change here. This program is unavailable. However, continue to see LOPs in sporadic basis, 99% good. Oh, good for you. Well, hopefully, I'll say hopefully it doesn't, I don't know whether to say hopefully or unfortunately, I don't even know what to say at this point. Um, it comes to you or doesn't come to you. I, I, I don't know. So... So Thomas, you said you here, if you drop below 50 AR, it's almost impossible to get to 70% because they send less and schedule less. I, I don't know, but I've kind of heard the same thing. So it kind of makes me want to stay above 70%. <laughs> I need to make my money. <laughs> uh, yeah, right, Sheila, this is me too. You can never sit in a parking lot for a half hour and wait for, I can, I can't do it. Uh, no, I've, I've always been that dasher. Like, I've never been um, hyper or anything like that, but like uh, even at home, like sitting through like an entire movie, like I, I twitch a little. So it's it's always been me that I have to like keep on going or keep doing something. But maybe that's just me. I don't know. <laughs> uh, but. Uh. So congrats. Oh, thank you. Did you see that? Can you believe that? So if you guys have TikTok, I don't even know whether I, I guess it's my own video. I don't even know whether I can share my own TikTok on YouTube. I don't know how that works. But if you guys have, um, if you guys have TikTok, um, I posted a video this week. It was not posted on DoorDash, so it's not the same content. And as of before I left to go out tonight, it was at 72,000 views. So, um, yeah, so it was, it's crazy. It's, I never expected anything like that. I've never had a short or something like that go crazy. So it was a lot of fun um, to see this week um, as it kept on growing. Yes, Josh, I still do Instacart. Um, yes, I still do Instacart. I've been focusing more on DoorDash lately just based off of everything that's been happening with Platinum and making sure like I was prepared for platinum. Um, but no, I still do Instacarts here or there. It's not as much as I was doing um, these past like two or three weeks. But yeah, I'll throw an Instacart here or there everywhere around. <laughs> So Tony, you don't have it, but you upped catering, but I've upped catering. That's awesome. Uh, you know, I, it's a, I've had a really, so far these past three days, I've had like good catering days. I had, you know, Cinco de Mayo. So happy Cinco de Mayo, everybody. But I had Cinco de Mayo on Sunday and then it was like full speed ahead for um, Monday and Tuesday catering this week. So it's been, um, it's been pretty, it's been a busy week so far. And it, I feel like it's only Tuesday. Does it ever get through that? Like you're starting the week, but you never really ended your week from the last week. So you kind of keep on going. I feel like that's, you know, the week that I had, I had to take off on Thursday this past week because my daughter was sick and then I wasn't feeling well. Maybe it was a little psychosomatic, um, but then she got over it. I got over it. And like, I was like full steam ahead going into the weekend, but. Uh. So Brock, you said today was slow, you know? It, you know, it was, it was slow here too. Um, I, uh, but I had, I think what kept me busy and maybe I just didn't feel the slowness is I had three catering orders today. I had two during lunch and then I had one in a later afternoon. Um, so, and then I kind of did DoorDash in between, you know, catering today. So it was, it was, for me, it was busy, but DoorDash, it could have been slow and I probably just didn't, I, I probably just didn't even realize it. Okay. So the three tier scam violates everything about, you know, I, the fact that we're even held accountable to an AR goes against independent contractorship. So I understand where you're completely coming from, just having, you know, acceptance rate 
Metrox is against independent contractorship. So I'm sure there's a loophole a lot somewhere um, out there that's allowing this to happen. I mean, I guess technically, I guess that's where tech now, tech now, oh my God, I can't speak tonight. <laughs> Um, technicalities, that's what I was trying to say, comes from, because technically, techni and this is loose or technically, you don't have to take every order. They're just telling you that if you don't take every order, then you might not get the money that you're desiring. So I always feel like it's like dangling the carrot over, you know, your head to, you know, to get more, uh, you know, I always said this, and I said this last week, and I've said this you know, a lot is even though DoorDash makes me the most amount of money, doesn't mean I agree with their business, their business practices, and them as a company. They do some really wacky things um, to drivers that kind of just makes your head spin and shake at the same time, if that's all possible. Uh, thank you, Christopher. Much appreciated. Like I said, I can't, I'm like, all of a sudden, it's like Mother's Day. I had like that, oh, crap moment today. I'm like, oh, crap, it's Mother's Day this, <laughs> this Sunday. I'm like, I have to get my butt in to gear and I will not be working on Sunday. If anybody is asking, I am not going to be working on Sunday. So before I forget, you know, happy Mother's Day to all the mothers that are watching and that are out there. I hope everybody has a fantastic um, day. So. <laughs> Oh, interesting. So Jersey Jack, you had your first quadruple stacked order on Earn by Time. I've never seen one on Earn by Time. Your standard pet smart, Five Guys, Starbucks, and Pot Pies. The payout was $42. That was pretty decent for a quad. Huh. I've never seen anything more than I think a step. Maybe I saw a triple once on earn by time. I don't think I've seen anything more than that. That's interesting that that even exists. Huh? Huh? You, ne you know, I I always say never say never, Josh. You said you would never do your ride share. I'll say never to you say never because I've said I've never going to do Instacart and I do Instacart. I've said I've never, I'll never do this or I'll never do that. And I turn around and I keep challenging myself to be better, a better person. I try to keep challenging myself to be a better content creator. I challenge myself to be a better DoorDash driver, a gig worker. I always continue to challenge myself, but <laughs> ride share just is not for me. I can honestly say I really don't think I really want anybody in my car. I'm going to be completely honest. And not only that, but I still have a booster seat for my daughter and taking it in and taking it out and taking it in and taking it out. I don't think I'll be seeing ride share any time soon. <laughs> Oh, nice. So you had a triple yesterday in Earn by Time. Oh, it was. I thought you, I thought for some reason I need to get my eyes checked. I thought, Chili, you said it was that high of a fan. I'm like, awesome. But you said it was that high. Sorry. <laughs> I'm telling you, sometimes you can get some really um, decent orders on Earn by Time, and sometimes you can get really burnt on Earn by Time at the same time. Um, from what, Sarah, I don't know this from what I know and from what I've seen, sometimes they'll send you an email to resubmit your catering bag and your equipment. I have not gotten that email yet. I figured if I don't get it within the next day or so, I am going to contact support and see what I need to do to submit it. Really? You were on LOP and never got an LOP order? I would have contact support. Um, did you contact support? I would have contact to support. Oh, I didn't see this. So under the ratings tab, it has K 
catering bag upload. I did not see that. And I kind of went through all of my tabs. I'm going to have to go back and see that. And thank you, Bubba Sue, for sharing that. So anyway, Platinum is here. It is going to be a fun and interesting week. I can't wait for us to come back in a week to really share how our first week and it will be officially in a week um, from next Tuesday, um, really to see what everybody's first impressions, if you're going to your for the very first time, um, it would be, I think it's going to be an interesting week for a lot of us. I think it's going to take a lot of figuring out, a lot of maneuvering. And guys, only thing I can say, if you are a dasher who is trying to maintain over 70%, watch your declines. That's the only thing I can say because I've heard from a lot of people that you decline one and it takes like 25. I'm being dramatic, but it takes a lot to climb back up. So just be careful if you're trying to maintain that platinum status. You don't want to get a roll of, you know, horrible order, horrible error, and the next thing you know, you lose your platinum status if you are one of those drivers. But anyway, um, there are 32 people here tonight. Thank you so much for being here. Um, guys, don't forget to give this video or this live a thumbs up. If you're new here, don't forget to um, subscribe while you're down there. Um, and I just really wanted to come out here tonight and really figure out how everybody was doing. It was kind of, a, you know, call it a status check on everybody and make sure everybody finally went live after a late afternoon rollout and kind of everybody's first impressions on their first um couple of orders um and we'll kind of we'll kind of see what happens i'm pretty sure you know i'll put out some kind of content out there as i see things as i'm going so i don't keep you guys in the dark um and we'll kind of we'll kind of go from there Yeah, I didn't see this either. You don't see an option to upload a picture in the catering bag. I, I didn't either. Um, that's why I said I figured if I didn't get the email within the next like one or two days, I was going to call support and tell them, hey, listen, I was on the large order program on platinum status. Do I really, do I need to resubmit my catering bags and kind of see what they did? The funny thing is, just real quick, a funny story. I did call support today to say, hey, I was supposed to go here. And it was supposed to be platinum. And this was probably around, I'll say 12 o'clock ish. And they just, I, I don't know whether it was in their script, but man, they played dumb. They had no clue what I was even talking about. They didn't even know what platinum was. They didn't even know what the rewards program was. But then in the same breath, they told me, oh yeah, well, look out for an email. It should be coming out later this afternoon. I'm like, how do you not know what rewards is? And then tell me it's going to come out later. It was so confusing. Shocker, right? <laughs> oh. Interesting. Hey, Kevin, how are you? Um, um I'm going to say... A wisdom warrior is it depends on your market. Some markets are good Instacart markets. Some markets are good Uber Eats markets. Some markets are good DoorDash markets. Kind of depends on what is uh, most popular in your own area. So unfortunately, a lot of times these gig apps are trial and error at this point. Um, and you kind of have to try for yourself to see really what works. Um, and it really even might differ by even driver at this point. But anyway, okay, you guys, I am going to call it a night. Thank you guys so much for being here. Happy Dasher Rewards. It has officially arrived. I cannot believe it. I feel like we've been talking about it for a month at this point. Um, but, you know, everybody go make your money. Do what you need to do to go make your money, but go make your money, whatever app you are working. And I hope everybody has a fantastic week. Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there. And I appreciate every single one of you. And if you haven't done so already, don't forget that thumbs up. So guys, thank you so much. If you're driving, please stay safe. Remember, kindness is always free. I love you guys. And I'll see you next video. Bye, everyone. Peace out. You heard
it's time.